detective and medical examiner come together to solve complex murder mysteries. And despite being complete opposites, they share an offbeat chemistry and a unique working relationship. Take a look. It is okay for you to want a relationship with your mom. I mean, you'd be even weirder than you are if you didn't want to know your biological mother. Okay, so now I am a whiny, weird pain in the ass. I'm trying to be patient. It must be very hard for you. It is. <laughs> and we're happy to welcome <laughs> Amos West, Angie Harmon, and Sasha Alexander. Hello, ladies. Hello. Hi. Uh, this show, the fourth season, premieres uh, tomorrow. Uh, one, you've got to just be, be giddy that it's four seasons so far. And two, this chemistry between the two of you is just so much fun. Uh, does this happen on and off the set? No. <laughs> no we never laugh. <laughs> never. <laughs> She's a drag! <laughs> Ooh. Okay, so now now I'm guessing we laugh too much. No, we do, we do. Uh, I'm guessing that are there. I'm sure the people at TNT right now are like, can you please just talk about the show? <laughs> because all we've done all morning long is just goof around and have a wonderful time. Because yes, actually we do have a pretty great time together. But you know, I mean, that's what happens when you are amazing women like ourselves <laughs> right. that work 15 hours a day together. That's what happens. Do you do you ever play jokes on okay, each I'm other? Done. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. Do we play jokes on each other? Well, the first mm. time I met Angie, she played a bit of a joke on me. Mm -hmm. But um, and the Birkenstocks joke. We had that. Well, yeah. She won't let me wear my Birkenstocks to set. That's not really a joke. My shoes are not a joke. <laughs> See, she thinks my shoes are a joke because I wear like you know flip flops, which she can't stand. But the Whoa. first. See, look, she does like a vomit thing every time I do it. Because she has like fancy shoes on every day at 5 o'clock in the morning. And I want to be comfortable. And then so she that won't work not with me. not true. Look at, look at this. Wow. Like, look at that. Oh, That's my. That's fanciness. Wow. wow. Mm -hmm. did, She's you, uh, a liar. did you borrow yeah. those from Elton John? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, like but I have fun. a pair of his. <laughs> oh, but, now, well, I, no. don't under, what, I don't understand. You don't like Birkenstocks, so I'm guessing you've never spent much time in Oregon. <laughs> yes. Well, see, and that's where I thought this story would be appropriate. <laughs> um, but she did. She had on some, some Birkenstocks, and we were rehearsing, and I was Jane, and she was Maura, and we were right in the middle of the scene, and I looked down, and I went, what are those? <laughs> and she goes, what? They're my Birkenstocks. I was like, yeah, no. No. But if you know fashion, you know that Celine just came out with a pair that are amazing, and they're fur-lined, and they come in, like, blue fur or red fur or white fur. I'm totally alien alienating the entire state at this point <laughs> and so I bought a pair of those which it became a very expensive practical joke but I kind of will do anything for a laugh so I walked in with those on and I was I made a very big presentation I went Sasha look at my shoes <laughs> and that and I was like that is a Birkin rock yeah. you can rock that stock right there <laughs> that's how you wear a Birkin stock and then she ripped them off my feet and I yes. haven't gotten them back <laughs> Well, your, your characters are kind of the opposite because Maura is the high fashion one, and then you, Angie, your character is not the high fashion one, yet in real is life, not. You, are, you are like the fashionista. I do love a bit of fashion. It is my weakness. I grew up in that world. I love fashion. Fashion to me is, is art. Is like if I had a, a, a vast art collection or if I went to a museum. That's what fashion is to me. I love it. Uh, we just got a phone call from TNT. They said, could you please talk about the show? <laughs> so let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Your the fourth season, what do you think is the appeal for all of your viewers? Because you, you have so many. The show is so popular. Why do you think it's so? Mara's outfits <laughs> <laughs> and her hair and her shoes. <laughs> it's definitely our hair. It's your hair, that's for sure. <laughs> that <is> mine. <laughs> Woo, that is faux show. We have no chemistry, None. and <laughs> that's a hurdle. It doesn't really translate either. Right. No, in the it writing. doesn't. No, it doesn't. So um, <laughs> we, I, you know, I mean, seriously, I think people, you know, we have a lot of fun crime stories, but. 
the relationship between Jane and Mara, and then uh, Corsac and Frost and Angela. There's a lot of fun family stuff. Well, my family's not very fun on the show, but her family's a riot. And so, you know, it's it, there's a lot of good um, good stuff to play, and it's fun to watch. So I, th I think that's what people enjoy. And it's also, it's not just like the typical crime drama where there's just the four talking heads standing around the body and talking about, well, his liver looks as if this happened. And what? <laughs> Great. Who <laughs> <It> cares? <laughs> you know what I want to talk about? I actually have to do that sometimes. I, I have to go, his liver is I like know. this. And then I say, that's nice. Did you fall in love with a serial killer this week? <laughs> <laughs> and then we just kind of go from there. There are no serial killer lovers this season, though. So we're, oh, we're off to a really good start. <laughs> well, we're very excited. Looking forward to the fourth season premiere. It's tomorrow at 9 p.m. on TNT. Thank you both very much. <laughs> oh, thank you thank so you. much. <laughs> I want to see the fur line Birkenstock. No, I, I'm surprised you don't have a pair, but those shoes were incredible, <laughs> weren't, weren't they? they? Yeah, yeah, you would love those if those I were are... taller. <laughs> would you? Yes, I would. <laughs>